Yo, what's the deal? The king is back once again. So let me just off the gate, you know what I mean? Off the top, praise it to the most high. You already know. I've been looking at some cars and it's literally the beginning of the month, like I said. And I already have two appointments with two dealerships. I'm gonna go be checking out some uh, some cars. You know what I mean? If you look at this right here, you see the back seat. The passenger side, you'll pull that forward. Get the back seat folded down. We got a decent amount of cargo space there. So, See what I'm all saying? right. Decent amount of cargo space there. Could lay a little mattress right there. You see, the thing is, is that these fucking weak ass perps are trying their best to reprogram my brain as we speak. So, these weak ass perps, like, I can feel them in my right ear. They're trying to, uh,. I guess recalibrate everything because it's off. So, you know, things are not the same. When you use neodymium magnets, reverse polarity, they start to deactivate the nano in your brain. And if you constantly use it, and low key, I just barely getting started. Like, I'm just barely testing this. So, like, the ideas that I have right now, like, I'm not gonna test them here because I know they collect information. Like, everywhere that I go, if you stay there too long, they'll set up around you. They'll encamp around you, all their little pussy-ass technology. And they'll, they'll build it up. So, if you're in a vehicle that you can sleep in, such as the one that I'm showing you right here. If you're in a vehicle that you can sleep in, it's a wrap, bro. It's a bloody wrap. You know what they're going to have to do? They're going to have to use, at night, They don't, their, their, their satellites charge up with the solar panel if they if they don't have jet fuel they have to be solar and um i don't know if they have like refueling stations i don't know exactly how they work but they must be solar they must be like anti-gravity i don't know what kind of technology they're using but anyways you know how much money it's gonna cost them if you keep re re, re positioning yourself every day you know right here they have a big electrical tower right here you know what i mean just for instance, let me show you. Just to so that we're clear. So that you guys understand because I can literally not only that, but I have things connected that are amplifying it. Like any fan that you have, any any appliance that you're using, they'll use it to pump certain uh you know 60 gigahertz of electricity plus the lily wave. And uh and you know this is this is what they they're using this is their freaking little setup right here that they have you know what i mean this setup right here see all this fucking electric bullshit right here all this fucking electric bullshit well they're not gonna i'm not gonna be sleeping by this anymore you know what i mean it's a wrap folks it's a wrap for these fucked hearts see and i'm laying it down so that people know if you live in a house you're, you're stuck. If you're going to be speaking truth, you can't stay in one position. Why do you think Richie from Boston is always traveling? That dude's, that, that dude's targeted too. And I have videos of, of him testifying on this. You know what I mean? So I'm going to show you guys just for instance... I have like four dealerships I can go to, like so many choices that it's impossible for them to pinpoint all of them. And a matter of fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to share all these people, all the freaking, uh, all the, uh, the, the motor vehicles, everyone that I come in contact with, I'm passing out my, my YouTube channel to. Yep. I still got, I still got freaking, what's it called? Flyers that I need to give. You know what I mean? Let me let me show you guys one second. Let me get my f flashlight real quick. You know what I mean? So their efforts are futile. 
because I'm going to spread so much information. I'm going to be on the go parking next to the beach. I'm going to get a surfboard. I'm going to be uploading videos of me surfing and stuff. You know what I mean? I don't care what people think, bro. I'm a freaking survivor, bro. You know what I mean? I don't give a shit what people fucking the shit that they talk. Right there. Bam. The rock right there. On steel. Fierro, which is my last name. Holding it down, bro. You could bend me, but you can't break me, boy. All right? If you don't know, my name's Anthony Fierro. Last name, my boys. F-I-E-R-R-O, so you don't get shit twisted. All right? So, yeah, bro, look, I got thousands of, look, everybody offering me. Yup, tomorrow, bro, 2 p.m., Bam, what do you want? Bam, 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 bam. Look at all this shit. Look at, you don't think I'm on the hunt, bro? What, six days ago, six hours ago, eight hours ago, fucking 10 hours ago, 23 hours ago, one day ago. Dude, I'm on the hunt, my boys. Trust and believe. I'm on the hunt, and I'm gonna get what I deserve. And I'm gonna freaking work hard for my shit. I'm gonna go fucking make my money, bro, like a real fucking man, not like these fucking cowards out here. You know what I mean? Not like these fucking cowards out here, bro. Nothing like these fucking cowards. You know, because it's, it's just, it's fucking, it's, uh, what you call it? It's like fucking annoying when you see this shit every day. Like, not only that, it's disappointing. It's like, oh, you don't want to be around this shit. You know, you want to just go out to like the woods separate from everybody. That's why parking next to the beach or whatever, like, Dude, there's so many places you can park, like, bro. <laughs> and then plus two, there's going to be no witnesses. So let some little stupid ass wise ass, wise ass perp try to come next to me and shit. Ain't nobody going to be around to fucking be a witness, bro. So if they get their fucking salad tossed, it's, it's not going to be a problem. You know what I mean? Because I got something for their ass. All the times that ever, like, I ever get into anything or whatever, my parents are around or my girlfriend is around or whatever, and they like to gang stalk me when people are around, so I can't really do shit about it. But trust and believe, let me catch one of these fools slipping and see what happens, bro. <laughs> shit. You better fucking have a camera on you with night vision, nigga, because I do. <laughs> fucking stupid ass puppets. Think this shit's a game, homie. <laughs> Oh, shit. Anyways, bro, it's not a fucking threat. It's a promise. And you don't know what I'm going to do. It doesn't It doesn't mean that I have to hurt you. I could hurt you in many ways, M mentally, physically, whatever. You don't know the things that I'm capable of. None of you fools know the things that we're capable of. Because we're peaceful people until you come fucking provoking us, you fucking dumb cunts. All right? <clears throat> But you know what they do, they're fucking good at. They just fucking skirt off like a little bitch like they always do. So with this fucking, you know, <laughs> forget my language, but it's hot as fuck right now. When it gets hot, niggas get mad. You know what I mean? Like we, we're heated. Shit. Bullets start flying and shit. You know? But um, yeah, bro, using this reverse polarity, it just, it, it pretty much, it, it, um, <clears throat> it freaking deconditions the brain d de uh you know it freaking um what's that word called uh, detoxifies it deconditions you know what i mean so like right now i went out i slapped my magnets on the perps would pass by they don't know when i'm coming but it's fucked up information that they're getting you know what i mean it's fucking demagnetized fucking information that they're getting so it doesn't matter. And plus, if I'm seeing, if, if what, that's what I witnessed right now, then it's even worse than what, what's coming, what I'm about to build. And then I have like, oh man, trust me, I have three or four good ass techniques, five good ass techniques that I haven't even tried yet. And, you t and you're telling me like, because the thing is, is I haven't got intricate with this shit. Like, for instance, the hard hat with a bunch of like, I would say 50 fucking reverse polarity magnets drilled into that bitch you know what i mean like <laughs> that shit is gonna be a fucking madman's device um like just this minuscule shit that i've been doing it's like you know 
little fucking copper, little fucking, you know, RFID fabric, little shit here, little shit there. You know, for, forgive me, but it's hot, bro. I've been sweating my balls off in here, and it's like, it's freaking hot to stay in a camper. And the reason that I have to be here, because I could be at my girl's pad, but, you know, not only is the house fucking perp, but, you know, I've caught this broad doing perp shit too but i i already i already don't even care about that like i uh, now i'm just too advanced where they can't even do shit to me like they can't target me anymore i'm not a target i i've be i've i've become overt on their ass you know what i mean and now i'm overt on them you know because i'm catching on to everything like tr trust and believe i'm taking down every single little note every single little way that they're trying to hack our body these frequencies these energies like i'm taking down notes bro and I'm, I'm taking them down good and i don't even have a freaking college degree and i'm figuring this shit out so you could only imagine how how pathetic these people are if, if 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 somebody like me can figure it out and i don't have a college degree which doesn't make somebody smart because what i don't even i think some of the you know the most uh intelligent people in history didn't even go to college or some of them didn't even go to college I don't know if Nikola Tesla did. I don't know if Edward fucking Einstein or whatever his name was. You know, there goes a little fuckboy right there trying to get into the video. I'll slap that fool up. That's all they do. They just pass by like little biatches and that's it. You know, so it's just like they run. You know, it's just like Tom and Jerry. They're just the fucking mice, you know. Um, what is it? Mice of men? Yeah, the little mice. <laughs> So I don't even need to worry about these fucking puppets, honestly. Fucking puppet! Anyways, yeah, so, I mean, I got so many choices, bro. I'm thinking of going something reliable, because I have, like, I was thinking about getting, like, a Lincoln Tahoe. I was thinking about getting a Lincoln, uh... What else? Let's see. I'ma just show you guys some, but like I'm not sure about these. Like I was thinking about I was thinking about getting this car. But like low key. Um dude, you don't wanna get a Range Rover and look at 144,000 miles. You know what I mean? Like that's already used. You know, somebody bought this, they used the shit out of it, and it's starting to give them problems, so they're selling it and they're gonna try to get another car. That's pretty much what's happening. So you're taking a risk on these cars. You have to look for something with low mileage and something that's reliable. So what cars can you get that's that are reliable? You know what I mean? Well, these are just some of the picks that I was looking at, but I already changed my mind. I'm not getting any of these cars. I'm getting I'm going with the smarter choice. I mean, I only went with these cars because they have a lot of um trunk space. But if you want to go with something like reliable, it would be like Toyota, Honda. You can just Google it. Google Toyota, Honda or uh, Ford probably are your best bet. But I mean, I was going to go with the Jeep. But I know Jeeps, they, they freaking mess up easily, bro. You know, 161,000 miles. Like, that's not a good, that's not good for you. Like, if you're trying to get your paper, you know what I mean? If you're trying to stack your chips and try to, you know, make a better life for yourself. And and then these these cowards are, uh, you know what I mean? They're trying to give you a hard time, you know, because they've been they've been straight blocking me trying to get an RV. So what I'm thinking I'm just like, dude, I can go to any dealership, find me a nice car and then just save up and get an RV like on the spot and drive to them. You know what I mean? I don't have to depend on anybody giving me rides or whatever. You know, I'm helping other TIs in the in the process. I just I just helped another TI, you know, not to be uh not to be boastful or whatever, but you know, it's I, I like to help people. It's in my nature. So I bought this dude a solar panel for like forty bucks. And um I'm gonna keep you guys uh up to date with uh <clears throat> You know, with with whatever I buy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a little video on my on my camera so that you guys can see. But um, but yeah, whatever. These perps are gonna have to work extra hard now. I just wanted to to post that up. 
you know what I mean? Because uh, they have their little sweet spot right here, but it's not. It's going to be over pretty soon, and I just want to make sure that they know and they understand that they're fucking pathetic, and I want them to know that. <laughs>